got up normal time. Never awake. That sounds cool. I got up at normal time, quarter to seven. Uh, that's, that's the time in Mexico when I do the stream, seven o'clock. I got up at quarter to seven, but I got a shower this morning. And, uh, oh, so nice and warm. Actually quite cold here at the minute. Even in the apartment. The apartment's colder than it's outside. A to start leads me to believe we need to run Chirola here, so that's what we'll pop in. And we're good. And I don't hear any audio. Oh, jeez, now I do. Wow. Uh, welcome to the world of Neverwake. This is Rem. And where is Ram? Use L to move her around the screen. Ah. Oh. Okay. The twin stick, is it? Yep. Whee! Flying twin stick. Okay. Completely approaching enemies. What have they got? Like, like snot hanging out of their eyes? Tap from behind, stay in the middle and learn enemy spawn patterns. Okay, R to trigger to unleash your special attack. Desperate times call for desperate measures. Wow! Whoa! Well, that wasn't as good as I thought. However, you can only unleash it so many times. Pay attention to the gauge in the lower left of the screen. Yeah. See it? Whoa! This is called a soul. Collect as many as you can to clear the stage. 10, 11, okay. That's where his soul counter is. And that's 22% of the souls that we need. Okay. Alright, this is loud for me. 62%. What's going on? Alright, tutorial over. <laughs> where am I? I can't... I can't move my arms and legs, my body, as I want. Heart, black hearts around her arms and legs. Somebody help me. That's Ram. Oh, she's missing a heart. That's who we're trying to save, is it? Never await. End of the demo. Thanks for playing. We'll <laughs> see you next time. I was only half joking then. Why finish demo? Oh! Oh, that's cool. You're breaking the hearts around the leg, is it? That's pretty awesome, alright. Yeah. So we have three stages here, it looks like. Alright. We don't get anything else, there's no like power-ups or anything, or... I feel like you're a bit of a hidden nuisance. We already got him. Why is this pitchfork in the middle of the screen? These things are scary. The ones that are hidden in the rock. Not super easy to see them. Uh Got my fingers on R. Pull the trigger if I really need to. 99.1. There we are. Without a single hit. Eh? Look down there. You can see we've got the bomb. Look, like the, the diamond at the bottom. But there's also... There's also like three little squares. Like a shield and, and, and something else. So I don't know. I don't know what that is. Look, there's a shield, there's like a wing, there's like a bullet with fire or something. Might not have that over abilities that we have. Or what, but... Well, we've gone from horizontal to, to vertical shooter. So I guess that's flexible. Alright. And 
only certain enemies seem to leave uh, souls behind. So I guess those guys in the wall, we actually don't even really care about fighting them if we don't have to. These ones, because they don't leave us. Oh, they do, but not much. It's better to fight big waves of them and leave a lot of souls. Loop two. Oh, we didn't do it in in, the, in time for one loop. Interesting. So maybe it would have been, oh crap, first hit. Maybe it would have been worth it to, to use our uh, our bomb to try and kill more enemies in a go. Okay. I have two shields there, so I guess you have two hits or maybe three hits before you die. Finished up the game. 11 minutes after, but can't stop ending. Oh yeah, you, I saw, I saw it. Um, Crisis, right? Crisis, what's that like? Remastered, because Crisis, I remember playing Crisis a couple of years ago and, and feeling, damn, this, this game feels so old, like it feels really old. Did it feel like that still? It just, it didn't feel like it had aged very well as like, uh, it was very, very, very like, it just, just old school. All these eyes. It's a style. It's a style. Oh, 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 oh. Eyeballs on a rotten carrot or something. It's down. There's another one over there. Right, there I am. There we are. Nails. Souls, baby. We're not quite 66%, so hopefully we still get enough souls for this. Boom! Shit! Oh my god, I was tempted. I, I tried to use my bomb then even, and it, it, it hit me. I think it's still counting as me using it, though, even though I didn't know. Uh, I don't think it triggered anything. It scared the crap out of me. Don't know if the bomb is supposed to just clear the map, or it actually does damage as well. Because I would have just used it for a bunch of damage on this third farm if, if I realised what it did. Alright, we good? Get out of here, you rotten loser. Very open approach to combat. Told but still very unique. It's like... Feels very Crisis-like, but, you know, not shit. <laughs> not Crisis! Uh, Far Cry. Like, original Far Cry-like. Just kind of these open areas. But just, just garbage. Is she trying to help me? The original bloody Far Cry, Jesus. The crisis actually worked. <laughs> and you had like cool abilities. I love that. That's so awesome. That's so awesome. That you're like breaking open the, the chains around her. Of thought. She's not awake yet. Background PC or console, slightly different games. Hey, uh, thank you for playing. Well, thank you. Um, it's okay. I'm going to give that one a three. Just a quick three. Uh, it was very, very, very basic. But it looked cool. It had like a nice story. I liked how the levels were laid out as well. Uh, just looking down there, you can see all sorts of crazy monsters and stuff and actual designs. I like that a lot. But uh, it still felt very, very, very simple. Never awake. But cool. It's a cool take on a non-original concept, right? <laughs> 